This last week, Harry's doing just great, living life, uh, taking care of his woman, and uh, that's why he isn't able to be here with us today, but uh, still driving around, says he's uh, proud that he goes out and gets his hair cut and does a little shopping now and then, but uh, the timing was just a little bad for our get-together and he'll be able to uh, share any time with us today, but he's doing well and he sends all of you his regards. So that's uh, probably the most important part, but down to the numbers of things here then. We had a skins game, as usual. Mr. Pat Conway in for one skin on number 12 with a deuce. Nice job, Pat. Jimmy Jenkins has two skins coming right out of the gates on number one with a tray and a net one on number eight. Woo! Nice, Jim. Jeff H. comes through with a three on number 14. Jeff. And nice job, Jeff. H. with a deuce on number six. Nice job, buddy. And uh, let's see, on the side games then. Closest to the pin on number five, Adon Valencia joins us today, my very good friend Adon. Nice job. On number eight, Eric Harriman. Nice job, Eric. On number nine, Russ Clark. Nice, Russ. Long drive on number 16, Barkley. Oh, no. No, Barkley didn't. Yeah. <laughs> I was well aware of that. Yeah. Ouch. Thanks anyway, Barkley. Good Long job, drive, Barclay. number 16, Les Feet. Yeah. Yes. Oh, that's oh, that's nice. Nice. Oh, thank you. We got to go by us anyway. I still think it should have been on 18. <laughs> <laughs> number eight, 17, the birdie hole. Russ Clark again, and yes, he did make the putt. All right. All right. Nice. This guy cleaned it up. <laughs> You'd be surprised how much money I picked up before Zach took over this stuff. Just skip over one of those. Yeah, I don't know where they got it. I miss being president. One thing that I did want to add here, though, to reminisce just a little bit about Harry. Barkley Martin, here today from the great state of Georgia. Yeah, yeah. Barkley. Barkley holds the uh, prestige of probably being the youngest member of Briarwood that uh, we've ever had. I'm, I'm guessing he was Years a ago. member of Briarwood probably at about age 12. Yeah. 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 Nice. Yeah. So we haven't had many 12 year olds since then. My kid uh, joined about the same time, and he's a year older than Barkley, so uh, he has that. And now he's back there, and uh, we were delighted that his schedule worked out so he could be with us today. Nice. And for today's game, the Harry. Low net is all that counts. A fantastic competition here. We have three gentlemen who all shot 71 net today. Yeah. A round of applause for all of you. Right now. Up the card then to uh, determine the winner of the cup. In third place, my good friend Ken Guillaume. In second place, my friend Laws, Mr. Laws. Oh, yeah. Thank you. He spends all this time recording us for posterity. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, some sometime like turn centuries around. from now, yeah. people turn are going to find. Yeah, now turn it around. I'll get it at the end. <laughs> it's because we'll be right there with them. And uh, number one off the card, my good friend John Ray. <laughs> nice. Was uh, certainly one of the very first guys to join the club, and I uh, can't think of much more fitting than for him to uh, get to enjoy the uh, Harry Cup for a year. So maybe Ken Guillaume, I imagine he would have a dissenting vote on that. But uh, okay, so that's it for uh, this month, September 12 at Glen Ivy. Will be our next get together. So. Uh, Practice your game and uh, come on out there and shoot some low numbers then. Great seeing everybody. Thank you for coming out. Nice, thank you.